Welcome to Moomoo Math and Science. In this video, I'd like to talk about the probability of dice. Many times on an exam, you may be asked, what are the chances of rolling a 7 or an 8? Or you may want to know which numbers are rolled most often with a pair of dice. Let's first look at a problem such as this. What is the probability of rolling an 8 with the sum of two dice? Use this formula the number of favorable events over the number of total events. This chart will help you understand this. When you roll two different colored dice, here's a chart of all of the outcomes. You have six outcomes on each die, so six times six gives you 36 outcomes, or different sums of the dice. This will be your number of total events. Now let's figure out the number of favorable events. There is only one way to roll a 2, a 1, and a 1. A 12 only has one combination of a 6 and 6. However, with a 7, you have 6 ways to get to 7. You can summarize the different ways to roll a number with this chart. So there are 4 ways to roll a 5 or a 9. This chart is easy to memorize. Start at 2, count down to 7, then back up to 2, and then in the last column back down to 6. So let's calculate the probability of rolling a 4. The number of favorable events is 3 divided by 36, reduce to 1 twelfth, or we divide 1 by 12 and get point. 0.083 as the probability. Probabilities are always between 0 and 1. The probability of rolling a 12 equals 1 out of 36 or 0 0.027. Remember this is the probability of rolling the dice not the odds. Odds is favorable to unfavorable. Which numbers are rolled most often? Here's a chart showing this. 7 has the highest probability, and 1 and 12 have the lowest probability of being rolled. So there we go, the basics of probability of dice. Thanks for watching, and Moomoo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.